about a week ago, we were dropped off in this very spot and we basically circumnavigated the entire island over the course of the last six days. How are you feeling after a week of being at sea? Happy and tired, I would say. <laughs> so this is something not strictly related with the space flight, but if you think about it, it's a kind of a set of skills that will be very much useful uh, and one week completely disconnected, unplugged from the rest of the world, it's been a good way to recharge the battery as well. In this environment, we don't know what is waiting for us. So it was an you know, amazing result that we came up with at the end to see that harmony goes forever. No matter what the circumstances are, no matter which environment we are in. Every morning when we we pack out the kayaks, getting into the kayaks and floating out on the um, uh, on the sea and just sitting there the first five minutes is just joy. Normally we're in a high-paced training situation, focusing on, on the mission and what to learn and uh, how to do something and how to do it better. Now we got more time to talk about things that we normally don't get time to talk about, so it was good. So I'm watching the crew, they're in a, an unusual environment. Um, we've taken them from all the creature comforts of home, uh, and if it didn't fit in the kayaks, it didn't get to come. And so it's not necessarily a physical health uh, component that I was, was keeping an eye on, but the psychological health and how the, the team came together as a group. And this group excelled, the way everything worked out as a, a team. So it was phenomenal. This is a dream team, it really is.